Hello, 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 Capricorns. It's Jackson Knowledge Goddess. I hope that you're doing well. Today I'm going to be doing your mind, body, and soul reading, which is about your spiritual progress. Please keep in mind that this is a general message, so everything may or may not apply to you in your situation, and that is okay. Please like, subscribe, and share with a friend who may need it. And also comment down below and let me know if it resonated with you. And if you would like to see more of me, hit that post notification bell next to the subscription button. And without further ado, let's begin. I feel like y'all are tirelessly working towards a goal right now. Okay. Capricorns, mind, body, and soul. Okay. So on your mind is balance. Okay. What's going on with the body? Body, yaddy, 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 yaddy. Some of you may even be getting into exercising. Okay, so you have the sacral chakra reverse. Okay, what's going on with the soul? What's going on with Capricorn's soul? Okay, so you have attachment. So I feel like you feel guilty for not balancing out a situation long before you did. I feel like you're in the mode of being empowered. Um, and you're finally listening to your intuition. I feel like your intuition has been speaking with you this whole time and you've just been ignoring it. But now you're realizing that you've been ignoring it. So let's see. What does Capricorns need to know about the mind? I feel like um, <clears throat> y'all are also in a stage where you're um, battling addictions as well. I feel like you're on a healthier path now. Also... I see that you guys, like I said, you're, you're learning to let your intuition guide you and you're learning where to put your energy and time now. You're learning how to better use your energy and time, okay? Some of you could be learning a lot about your tradition or you're thinking about doing something the traditional way. <clears throat> Um, or I feel like you've learned how to simplify your problems as well. Some of you <clears throat> may, <clears throat> excuse me, some of you may even be thinking about going to a counselor. <clears throat> Yeah, y'all could be thinking about going to a counselor, okay, or um, you're thinking about um, how to how to better um, get in tune with your spirituality. Uh, some of you are fighting for your respect, or there's a need for you to fight for your respect. Okay. Don't let anyone take away anything from you. Okay. I feel like you're you're learning to work smarter, not harder when it comes to a certain situation. Yeah. I feel like you're handling things more uh, efficiently. Or you're thinking about how you can handle things more efficiently. Um, I feel like y'all are thinking a lot, but, um, like I said, you're learning different ways on how to balance that out. <clears throat> mm -hmm. I just heard spiritually poor. So yeah, I feel like you're learning to communicate, um, you know, with your divine team a lot more. Um, 
and you're you're not letting things get to you like you used to i feel like you're just tired i feel like you you have something that you want to do and you're putting all of your efforts towards that instead of putting it towards things that um are just not beneficial for you anymore which could pertain to another person um that i feel like okay You're learning to master your own energies. Some of you may even be like separating from someone or getting some type of divorce. Or somehow <clears throat> um, something unexpected happened. And it could have been a bad situation, but I feel like... Um, it was one of those bad situations that end up being good for you anyway, for your sanity. Okay. I feel like you're figuring out new ways to handle these situations. Okay. Or um, someone could be helping you figure out how to handle these situations better. Like I said, could even be a spiritual counselor. Um, you're definitely <clears throat> definitely working on your emotions I feel like they were very imbalanced I feel like it was a very toxic time in your life that that is passing now Yep, exactly. You have the devil card. <clears throat> Some of you could even be battling sexual addictions. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me, y'all. Okay. And you're just now realizing it. I feel like um, that could have been the toxicity within... Uh, some type of connection that you had and that was the reason that you stayed attached to it but I definitely feel like you're growing out of that I feel like that's how someone kept you bound okay okay yeah you're conquering your fears with that, if you haven't already. Um, I feel like you're you're finally strong enough <clears throat> to acknowledge. Excuse me, y'all. Hold on. Okay, sorry about that, Capricorns. I had to get my voice together. Um, but anywho, I feel like you've been getting signs and synchronicities on how to move forward. Um, I feel like you felt locked locked into a space um with someone but you you're learning to pick up the signs and synchronicities that the divine is is trying to that have been trying to give you i feel like you're finally paying attention to the little things and that's helping you along your path here <clears throat> You're learning when to give and um, you're learning when to hold back as well. And that's, you know, this may seem little to other people, but this is a big achievement for you. Okay. What's the stone card? Um, I also feel like if you do um, achieve something, be careful of being greedy. Okay. That's for some of you. But if that's not your case, um, do bask in your glory. If this is some type of achievement, okay? This is Knight of Swords. Yeah, I feel like... Um, excuse that noise, okay? I swear to you, every time I open this window, all of a sudden, all these cars want to come by. Anyway, um, I feel like you, you have gotten... Uh, the information that you needed to move forward this was going on with the body so in the physical um 
Yeah, you've gotten word on how to proceed in a certain business endeavor. And that's going to help you be super successful. I feel like that's very good for you because I feel like you, you have felt like a failure for so long. But those are just lessons, okay? What's this page of cups? What's this page of cups for Capricorns? I feel like um I feel like you're also getting <clears throat> starting to be around kindred souls, people who who share the same common goal as you and that is really helping you move forward um and you're learning a lot from each other. Um uh, For some of you, you may even be meeting like a new romantic partner and um I see this being total fulfillment for you. Yeah, but I see you holding back from that because of some things in the past. I feel like, um, you know, moving forward, put, put the effort that you need to put in it, in it. But, you know, just learn from your past. When you're moving forward and you see a situation that could have, you know, happened, um, like the past have happened, handle it differently this time. Smarter, not harder. Okay. Um, if this has to do with business, the same thing. Work smarter, not harder. You know what I'm saying? Don't give too much of yourself. But um, also, don't not put in the effort that you need to put in. Okay? I feel like you're really leveling up. You're really upgrading here. Whether it's whatever it is for you. I feel like your hopes, your hopes and dreams and wishes are finally coming true. <clears throat> so don't sabotage them. This is a very good thing for you, okay? And there will be a lot of effort needed, a lot of work needed. And also know that you don't know everything. And be open to learning these new things that you need to learn in order to move forward. And, and don't be holding back your feelings, okay? Speak your mind. Don't be afraid to just because there were problems in the past. Okay, so let's see what's going on with Capricorn's soul. So I feel like your soul, like I said, felt trapped in some type of cycle. But your soul is ready for this change. Yeah, your, your soul is ready for this change. Okay, what else do we have? Yeah, exactly. You have the Ten of Wands. You've learned all the lessons that you needed to learn. And now it is time for you to move forward. This is a new beginning here. It's time for you to move forward. Okay. You've learned those lessons. You've done enough. I feel like everything, I feel like now... These lessons are more like a hollow shell. Like there's no no more life to give. Okay. You can finally be free. You can finally be yourself moving forward. That's what your soul needs. Your soul needs to be expressed authentically. Okay. Okay, yep, you got the page of staffs. You have the two of swords. So I see you knowing kind of what you want to do. Um, and then you start to feel unsure. I feel like you're going to be having someone who's going to encourage you. Um, like I said, who's going to help you. Okay, you got the Ten of Swords. Don't, I feel like, stop thinking so much about it. Stop thinking too much into it. And just go with your gut instincts here. This is Ten of Staffs. But there's a new beginning here for you. And I feel like you, you've been so accustomed to all of the bad and crazy toxic situations that it's kind of like you don't know any better. Okay. This is Ten of Staffs. 
Yeah. You have the ten of stat I mean uh ten of wands again. It's over. Don't don't go back and forth. Don't go back. This is page of status. Staffs. Yep, this is y'all's energy too. The King of Pentacles. What's this Ten of Swords? What's this Ten of Swords? Um, learn to take it slow. Okay, you're still in the healing process, so moving forward too fast. Um. Is not going to be beneficial for you. Just take your time moving into this new era of your life. I feel like your soul is going through a, a major transition. Um, and you're beginning to see things a lot more differently. Which is how it's supposed to be. So, you know, if you find yourself um, having new values. You know, if you thought that mustard was the best sauce in the world before. You may think it's the worst sauce now. And that's okay. You can go to catch up. It's fine. Um, it's not a betrayal to who you are. That's actually being more authentic with yourself and being more real with yourself and saying, hey, I just don't like mustard anymore. And that's okay. That's okay. Moving forward, let your intuition guide you. You know, if you're making a decision, just close your eyes. Close your eyes and meditate on it. Is this good for me? Is this what I need? Also, I feel like working on visual visualization techniques is going to be good for y'all. Um, so be thinking about what do you want moving forward? Um, you have blossoming abundance at the bottom of the deck. I see angel of love. Which means love is coming in. And also, um, you have the King of Pentacles twice. So some of you may definitely be getting some type of promotion. Or um, I see you succeeding in a new business endeavor. Okay? Do not let the past hold you back from this future. Because I've been, I've been pretty much watching y'all Capricorns. Y'all been going through it for a while now. Um, and I feel like you're finally ready for this new phase. You've learned everything you needed to learn. Do not let nothing and no one hold you back. Um, if you don't have the finances that you need to move forward just yet, you're going to be getting it. And that's definitely going to boost um, boost a lot of energy for you to move forward. But I definitely see good things. I feel like you're, um, it's kind of like you're a snake right now shedding that old skin. Okay. Um, and that is wonderful, okay? So, this is good spiritual progress. Do not feel guilty or regretful about things that have happened in the past. Those were just lessons, okay? Those were lessons. Take them with you. And embrace this new future that you have, okay? So, this was your reading. Um, if you would like to donate to me and my, uh, my channel... My cash up is going to be in the description box below. Thank you all so much. I'm so very proud of you. Congratulations. You've upgraded. Okay. All right. Thank you. I'm out.